that as well. All right, we have crews out and about for you, a team coverage of Florence, and we're going to begin tonight over in Darlington County. That's where we find our Lauren Thomas this evening. And Lauren, it's been raining over there, and the wind is howling pretty good. Yes, we can hear the wind howling, JR. And kind of wondering if there were people around us uh, walking around, but it's just the wind. Uh, but one thing that they were concerned about were power outages. And we looked at the power outage map and 6,000 plus outages are in Darlington, town, Darlington County. 28% of the county is in the dark right now. And what a difference a block makes because over on this side of the street, uh, we're on Carolina Avenue. They have lights, they have power, but on the other side of the street, you can see there's absolutely no light over there other than the light that we're pointing in that direction. And the good thing is, though, people are heeding the curfew warning. That curfew went into effect at 7 p.m. And so uh, it goes into effect. It continues until 7 a.m. And one thing that we did notice earlier is that there are crews out at the Darlington Raceway, line crews waiting for these power outages. Um, and the ability to come out and fix these power outages because there are businesses, restaurants, hotels that are without power this evening in this area. Right now we're in Hartsville uh, and in Darlington County, but earlier today we got a chance to speak with Senator Gerald Malloy, who spoke a little bit about how they were preparing these crews to go out and handle these power outages. If you've gone by the racetrack, you see that they probably have 20,000 um, units that's over there that's, that's ready to handle the storm and they're all parked over at the racetrack to get, to get folks um, electricity back up as soon as possible. And as far as the, the outages, um, you know, as long as the wind is not blowing, they've already started trying to end up correcting those that have gone, that have gone out. That's the information I got this, this morning. So um, keep your spirits high um, and, and try, to stay, try to stay safe. Now, for those people who are without power this evening in Darlington County, we know that there are four shelters in place right now. Hartsville Middle School, Darlington Middle School, LeVar High School, and Ray, uh, Rosenwald Elementary School. Those are the four shelters that are available throughout Darlington County. Again, we're seeing power outages up to 28% throughout the county at this time. More than 6,000 power outages. So people are trying to uh, hopefully heeding that 7, 7 p.m. curfew warning, and that goes into a effect again until 7 a.m. and will continue each day until the storm passes and the county gets a good grip on what's going on here uh, in terms of tropical storm Florence. But reporting live in Darlington County, Lauren Thomas, News 19, WLTX. All right, Lauren, thank you so much.